click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida Hello friends, in the previous lecture we have understood that is what is the structure of alcohol and now in this topic we are going to talk about the physical nature or physical properties of alcohol so now let's get started with it. So friends in this topic we are going to cover the physical properties of alcohol so here are we have the few physical properties and those are nothing but that is physical nature or order we could say the next one is boiling point and solubility so talking about the first point that is physical nature and order of the alcohol so it has been found that is the alcohols which are of lower member they have basically they are colorless and they are liquid in state and obviously they will have a distinctive smell or pleasant smell but talking about the alcohols which have a content of more than 12 or more than 12 carbon atoms obviously they are colorless they are odorless as well as they are solid in nature so talking about this was something which was related to physical nature or physical appearance and order. So talking about the next point that is boiling point. It has been found that is the alcohols are having a higher boiling point compared to that of alkyl halide, alkane or we could say like aldehyde also. So this would be clearly indicated if I give you a certain example. For example if I would say, so suppose if we discuss about propanol. So propanol is the one which has a molecular mass of 16 and it has been found that is the boiling point of propanol is nothing but 370 Kelvin. I talk about the other one that is with respect to that. Suppose if we talk about ethyl, ethyl ether. Even it has a molecular mass of 60, but it has been found that is the boiling point of ethyl methyl ether. It has been found to be that is 283 Kelvin. I talk about the other one that is suppose if we talk about propanol. That it is we found that is the molecular mass is basically 58, which is almost related to that of 16, while it has we see 322 Kelvin as a boiling point. So it has been clearly indicated that propanol or alcohol they have higher boiling point compared to that of the aldehyde or compared to that of that is ether. So it is not only ether, but it is also applicable for the alkyl halides as well as we can also say like for alkane. So this was related to the boiling point. But what is the reason behind? The higher boiling point of the alcohol. The reason behind that is hydrogen bonding as well as the metabolic force. For example, if I talk about alcohol, it is clearly understood in the previous lecture that is during the structure of alcohol. We have got to know that is the alcoholic oxygen is the one which is basically more electronegative. So that is the reason that it has capacity to form hydrogen bonding with that of the other that is alcohol molecules, and that could be given with the help of a small formula right here. That is, suppose if I consider alcohol that is ROH. Suppose if I'm considering the another alcohol where I could write it as that is HOR in this manner. So in this case, basically hydrogen bond forms only between the oxygen and that is hydrogen atom over here in this case. So therefore, the oxygen which is partially negative and the hydrogen which is partially positive, obviously we understand. So therefore, there will be kind of force of attraction between this oxygen atom of one alcohol and other alcohol. So that is how basically this kind of interaction between the two alcohol makes this alcohol to have a higher boiling point. So not only the hydrogen bonding is the main reason, but also metabolic force of attraction. So even it has been found that is the metabolic force of attraction is more in alcohol compared to that of the other one. So like suppose if you compare it with the aldehyde or suppose if you compare it with alkaline. So this is the reason behind that alcohols have higher boiling point. But it is also been clearly understood that it is a straight chain alcohol is basically having a higher boiling point compared to that of a branched one. So that's the reason that uh, because of the metabolic force of attraction it decreases for the branching alcohols and that's the reason that the boiling point it actually decreases and so that was related to the boiling point and now let us move on to the next point that is solubility. So talking about solubility it has been found that is the alcohols the lower members of alcohols they are very much soluble in water and the reason behind that is obviously they form hydrogen bonding and because of which basically they are very much soluble in water but talking about the alcohols which are having a higher molecular mass or they have a higher or bigger structure so they don't have that much of higher uh, hydrogen bonding and that's the reason that they don't soluble in water so they are not miscible in water so that is the reason that the solubility of alcohol is maximum when the alcohols are of lower members so this were the few properties or few physical properties of alcohol that is what i have discussed about in this lecture so that's it so thank you friends for watching this video i hope you have understood this video very clearly and i hope i will see you next time and then don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you so much